We're here at Rib Kill Planet Day and today we're working with a number of local community groups. The group is planting 250 sedges and rushes and their aim is that they'll filter the stormwater of nutrients and rubbish before it enters the ocean. We're standing here in Spring Creek Valley restoring the grassy woodland with this little tree which is the ballerine yellow gum. Um, this is a site that's been revegetated quite a while ago but it keeps getting weed invasion from grasses and particularly the angled onion. Weed management's one of those things that if you don't stay on top of it, it'll get away from you and that's where groups like Rip Curl come in handy with the Planet Day. It actually makes jobs like this possible. It just so expedites the whole process of revegetation when we've got a keen group of people that are coming down with us. It's one of my favourite days of the year, you know. It's fantastic to be able to give back to the community. Uh, my favourite part is getting out of the office and connecting with crew that I don't usually work close to. It gets you away from the keyboard, it helps you just kind of reconnect, different change of perspective. Contributing to, the, to where I live. And actually learning about what actually is in our backyard. This is my 20th planet day. However many years it's been going, Minus two and that's probably it. It's been 21 years that Rib Curl has been running our Planet Day and that just goes to show how connected it is to our company and brand values. Our company value of community and environment, you know, it's all about acting locally and thinking globally about how we can contribute to the community we live in and the environment that we live in. Here in Australia, we have spent 3,500 days planting 100,000 trees. And the biggest highlight is that out of those 100,000 trees, we have an 80% long-term survival rate. And that's just the start of what's been achieved with the Rip Curl Planet Day. It means that community has been able to greatly expand our expectation of what we can achieve in any given year. This makes a real difference to try and improve the quality of these areas so they're not deteriorating over time with uh, you know, urban pressures and increased development around the coast. I really take my hat off, I guess, to businesses like Rip Curl who are able to provide that certainty year after year after year. The future of Planet Day is that it's absolutely here to stay. We love it and we want to see more people involved. So we're going to expand it to ensure that all of our Rip Curl regions and licensees participate, our suppliers, our customers, our athletes. I really look forward to seeing it bigger and better every year.